My hair is breaking off. I thought something was gonna fall. <laughs> okay, hey girl, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna do a little review, kind of rundown on this guy here. So this is called the Wig Fix from the Renaturel. So what it is, is a wig grip. So I'm gonna take it out and show you. It looks like this. It's a silicone wig grip. So you wear this under your wigs and it's supposed to give you extra security. And I'm gonna read you the card that it comes with so you can kind of get like a little bit of a rundown of what it does. So the Wig Fix makes wearing wigs secure, safer, and simple. Benefits. Provides roller coaster proof wig security. Did someone say roller coaster proof? Okay, so I actually put this to the test. I'm going to include some footage later on, so we'll see if it really is roller coaster proof or not. So stay tuned for that. All right, it reduces and removes the need for glues, tapes, clips, and combs. Um, that's kind of the gist of it. So it takes two seconds to apply, lasts for years, really quick and easy to clean. And then it kind of just gives you instructions on how to put it on. So just kind of put it behind your hairline. You can tint it if you need to using makeup. And then you put your wig on top. That's basically it. I feel like it's pretty self-explanatory. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try it on for you guys and kind of show you how it looks. So let me put my wig cap on. And so now I'm just going to apply my wig fix. So you can see that it has little like nubs on it and they're on both sides so I don't think there is necessarily like a right way or a wrong way I think you can wear it pretty much either way so I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of go like this and put it on like that and it fits really good and snug so let's put on the wig and I'll show you what that looks like all right, so this is my Jessica wig. I have a few other videos on this wig, so if you guys wanna check that out, I'll link them in the description box. So this one does come with an elastic band, and I am gonna show you what this looks like and how it works with a wig without an elastic band or without any like combs or anything, so we'll test that out after. But I wanna show you this one first. So let's put this on. All right, so this is what the wig looks like on, and if you look at the parting, you actually can't see the wig grip, I think it's right there, but you can't really see it. So it's pretty discreet. And I have to say, okay, so I did wear this already. And the first time I wore it, I thought that it added a little bit of bulk. Like I thought it was kind of lifting, but now that I wear it, it really isn't adding any bulk. Like my hairline is still lying really flat. So maybe it was just the way I had it positioned. I think maybe I had it too close to the front and right now I think it's a little bit further back so that might be the trick because I think the first time I wore it it was a little closer to the front and it was kind of lifting the lace at the front and I was like oh I don't know Oops, focus and I was like oh I don't know if this is gonna work but now that it's a little further back I still feel that security and it does look pretty pretty seamless in the front so that's good so I've already worn it before with the same wig and I feel like it did kind of give me a headache. I think maybe just because the pressure around like of the wig grip and the pressure of the elastic band like together was kind of giving me a headache like around my head. So I'm curious to try it with a wig that doesn't have an elastic band. So that might be another way to go. So I feel like this grip might not be for like every wig. So you might have to kind of like pick and choose which one is going to be the most comfortable for you and which one you need a grip with the most, if that makes sense. But how secure is it? Is it really roller coaster proof, like they say? So I wanted to put it to the test and I have footage of me wearing this on a roller coaster, like this wig and the wig grip and everything. So I'm going to show that to you in just a second. So I'm going to tell you like a little story. So I wanted to originally go on like a real roller coaster like I can as Wonderland like I was gonna go upside down like I was gonna go all out but the timing didn't work out so I ended up going on a roller coaster you know the one in Santa Monica I don't know if you know but I'll put a picture in case you don't know it's kind of a dinky roller coaster it kind of just goes like like <laughs> in waves but I figured you know the wind is blowing it's still a roller coaster so I'm gonna put the footage here while I'm talking because the footage isn't really that interesting. Spoiler alert, it's roller coaster proof. So I'm going to put the footage here. Okay, so I 
had this whole plan to go on this roller coaster to take this video for this video. Yeah, like to take the footage for this video. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> so I'm like walking up to the roller coaster and there's signs everywhere. They're like, no phones on the roller coaster. You can't have your phone on the roller coaster. No phone on the roller coaster. And I'm on the roller coaster and they're like, everyone, make sure you don't have your phones. And I'm like, so I'm recording this. You can tell I'm recording it like from my lap. Like my phone is in my lap and I'm trying to be super discreet about it. Like the angle is not, it's not it. But I'm like doing like, you know, I'm trying to do my thing, trying to get that thumbnail shot. You know what I mean? Trying to like, ooh, like have like a cute moment. And I don't know how they clocked me. Like they called me out for having my phone on the roller coaster. I'm like, how can you see what I'm doing when I'm like, when you're over there and I'm on the roller coaster over there, like, how can you see? Like, I thought I was being so low key and discreet, but they totally called me out and they were like, gonna kick me off the roller coaster, even though I already went on the roller coaster and I already had my phone. So like, just kick me off, like <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> but yeah, so as you can see, it's roller coaster proof. It's blowing in the wind. You can kind of see my like coral hair underneath. I think it's just the way I had the my wig like it's not don't worry it's not like slipping off it's just the way the wig is and this wig is like a little bit big for me it's a large and I should have got a medium so you can kind of see my hair but that's not the wig slipping that's just like how the wig is so yeah long story short it's roller coaster proof I do want to kind of try it on like a real roller coaster like going upside down and everything so let me know if you want to see that I don't know maybe I'll do another video in the like in the summer, but I don't know. So instead, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna test out, like we're gonna do a little roller coaster simulation here. I'm gonna do some some head banging for you and like really see how secure this wig grip is on a wig like this that has no combs, no elastic band, no anything. So let's go ahead and test that out. So I'm gonna take this one off and we're gonna switch. All right, so this is the wig with no combs, no anything. So first I'm gonna try this on without the wig grip so we can kind of see the difference. So I'm just gonna like throw this on. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> I know, this wig is like, it's it's a moment. Okay, so I'm just gonna do a roller coaster simulation. I don't really have that much room. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> so. All right, let's pretend I'm I'm on a roller coaster or something. <laughs> okay, ready? <laughs> okay, so it flew off. Okay, let's try it with the wig grip. All right, so now I have the wig grip on, so let's see how how grippy it is compared to without the grip. Okay, just don't mind this wig. Okay, hold on. This is for demonstration purposes only. Okay, so it does feel pretty secure. All right, let's do the same headbanging simulation. Hold on. Okay, it's the same as before. I put on the same. Okay. All right, let's go. <laughs> Cue the, the metal music. Oh my gosh, it's actually really staying. Like, <laughs> like obviously if I'm pulling it, it's gonna come off, but. So I feel like even if I was on a real roller coaster, like it would stay. So I feel like the wig fix does work better for wigs like this that don't have like any combs, any clips, or any elastic bands. Because the wig like this that already has an elastic band, I mean the elastic band kind of already gives you that security and I think wearing that on top of the wig fix kind of gave me a headache. So I think it definitely works better for a wig like this that doesn't have any security except for the wig grip or the wig fix. And I'm going to leave all the information for the wig fix down below so if you guys want to get one see in the description box down below. And they did give me a coupon code as well so all the information will be in the description box down below. So let me know in the comments, would you ever wanna try something like this? Did you like my head banging? <laughs> let me know your thoughts and everything like that in the comments down below, and I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching, bye.